This is the perfect spot for Nuguri. Look at that yeah, rage bar. Nuguri's about to turn into Meganar. He's looking for the... Oh, but the scatter the weak is so crucial for Angel, but he's got flash available. Stun doesn't land onto the enemy the AP carry, and now Doom B into the fray, but they don't have the damage. Angel has to go into his Sonya's. Juan Fong desperately trying to fire away, but Doom B is completely indestructible on the back line. Remount and just keeps them busy forever. You cannot deal with the Kled and the Skull. There's too many of them with this Yordle. Doom B will not die. But SOFM will, that's for sure. Rooted up, gets underneath the tower though, and now Bin's re-arriving into the fray. On trying to do his best, but Bo's arrived as well. And On suddenly finds himself alone in the world. Baron is up for grabs, and FBX might have just won the fight that they needed. Makuya will have his Mega Nar just about. Shanks though will be saved by missing. They do drop in the Cannon Barrage and they keep peppering him down. He's forced to flash away. There is Jomong jumping straight in on top of Light. And that's a fantastic engage here for my Wandi. Gets on top of all five members as the fight kind of re-engages. Icon goes golden, keeps himself alive. The feathers fly backwards, but it catches nobody out. It's actually a trade of support for mid laner. Oh! Too bad Shockwave, and that's the go button. Fantastic move from Shanks. He courts them in and takes takes them down, I won the, it's a quadra kill. Down to 4,000 HP right now. Lillian is in the vicinity, but can he actually close the distance? It doesn't look like it. And Meteor is going to sneak away this Baron. Mark, however, going very, very low. He's going to fall down. Zika on the wrong side of the map. They do find Lillian, but how many kills are they going to get traded away for the Baron? Fofo finds another one. It's already two down on the side of BLG. It's going to be a couple more. Zika's not going to be able to escape from this one. But uh, if it's only two kills, I would still say pretty favorable. Oh, wait a minute. Never mind. Zika somehow finds a miracle escape, forces the flash out of Eye Boy, and the Eye Boy is the one that falls down, baited by the perfect timing. Can't oh. Fofo equalize this? He finds the damage, but unable to get the final kill. He uses the heal, goes in, has a Gale Force, and he dies too. Straight up daylight robbery, to be honest, to get that trade. But Kramer, oh, Farmer Kramer. You don't get to just tend your fields at this point in the game. Oh, Not a back on chance as well. Jackie Love gets his 19th oh double of the game, but he wants a little bit more as he grabs the triple Uniboy. Desperate to survive this one. Jumps in, but he's just going to get stunned up and annihilated by Knight. I don't think he can close the gap. In they go with the Gale Force to take them down. Forge on 1 HP, but he's crit to fall. And a reheal. He doesn't have that unbreakable will. He already used it, and he's taken down for the triple.